Alright, welcome back. Let's play Brain Lord for the Super Nintendo. I have um, played a little bit off screen uh, before I decided to reload. And I decided to go back to the Tower of Light. I hope you can bear with me here for a moment. It is a bit of a journey. But I think it will be worth it. I have completely forgotten uh, one of the secret areas. And I'm going to see if I can make that jump. I should be able to. This is a big jump. Uh, I should be able to make it. It's basically a... Uh, if I jump on this one, I should get to this tile here. And, well, I should be able to make this jump. And I'm pretty certain that the treasure there should be worth it. Uh, for the last thing I cannot reach, I am possible. Anyway, I'm 
Spell. Magical Wallet. It's not a great item, but it's better than nothing. Uh, it's basically generating money over time. Uh, long story short, um, it generates money, and if you use it, um, the money uh, goes out of the wallet into your account. If you die, the money in your wallet does not get cut in half. So that's pretty useful. No, I do not dying, it's so nice. And I am going to walk to the ruins just in case of bumping into the kids. It might be that they are only there at a certain point in the game. Am I reaching the second or third floor? I do not know. And I'm still going to check. Yes, I know my buffer uh, is degrading pretty fast. Not to worry. If it's degraded, it's degraded. One will be very useful. Azun is not a gay. I want to give him a different name. Let's see here. Let's just give it a pro. Jack in a few areas. I'm not a fan of that. 
Let's play Brain Roar for the Super Nice. 